Hi everyone, I, I'm going to introduce you our new application Cardbook. Cardbook is a trustless program application that is used to exchange contacts. Uh, so I'm not going to go that much into details now, I, I will just briefly describe how it works uh, and the general concepts and our vision. If you would like to connect to us to get more information just feel free, there is a uh, about button in the application which gives you complete detail about uh, how to contact us. So um, we have two phones, both of them have installed the Cardbook application, so let's open it. Okay. Uh, when you open the application first time it shows the, you the intro screen. Uh, uh, this is just standard uh, details about uh, how to use application, uh, what it does, uh, you, of course you can skip these steps. The next thing is regist registration. Uh, don't care about this. Uh, this is just uh, in order to get a uh, unique identifier for you because we need to identify you in, our, in the net network to uh, be able to exchange uh, your data with other members. So, uh, by the way, this application doesn't store anything about you, so your data is completely secure and your data uh, is completely anonymous. No one can intercept between uh, you and server that will exchange the data. No one can decode the data uh, that you have already encoded, so only you can access your data. So only you know about your contacts, their details, their names, their phone numbers and so on. Uh, so let's go to registration. I just uh, fill dummy details here to make it fast. So as you see, you just enter the uh, very basic details like uh, when we use paper-based visit cards. Uh, there is a name, surname, phone number and so on. The same is here. So the main goal of this application is to replace the currently used paper-based visit cards and give you a great tool which will use new concept, new electronic visit cards. So let's go register. Oh great. So we have registered on this phone. The same let's do for this one. Nice. <coughs> so we have both of them registered. So they have, uh, they already have their unique identifiers. However, you should note that uh, your identifier is stored locally on your phone. So in the case if uh, the program will be damaged or I don't know something like that, your data will be lost because uh, your data is stored only on your phone and nothing uh, nowhere else so as you see we have just basic tabs home contacts uh, as you are new to this net network you don't have contacts so it shows you that you uh, that your contacts are empty this is your electronic version of your visit card so the data that you entered before is shown here and the about tab that I told you before so okay let's let's go and test how it works. Uh, so when these two phones want to exchange the data uh, they press the button but the trick is that, that they should be in the same geographic location if uh, for example this guy will be out of this room it will not work. So uh, so let's try for example let's uh, only push uh, this phone's button what it does now, it requests to the server to see if whether is another uh, near near is another guy who is doing the same, and if they are both doing the same, it means they are uh, they want to exchange data between each other. However, it finds out that there is no one. So uh, let's do both of them simultaneously. Oops, sometimes it, should, it, it may happen because uh, 
because of internet connection or because of the slow performance of the phone okay see uh, uh, now the uh, this guy finds out that this guy wants to exchange uh, his contact details with him so it is just a standard alert screen would you like to exchange your details with this guy uh, and just uh, n uh, notice that uh, th uh, this name I entered here so they identify each other very very uh, easily so if you will press no then nothing will happen it will just uh, you will just uh, don't exchange anything with this guy. So let's pr uh, let's press yes. Okay, great. So you have, uh, as you see, it switched to the next tab, contacts, and uh, gives you information that you have uh, successfully exchanged your data. So as you see, these two guys, they have now their. This guy has the contact of this guy, and uh, vice versa. If you would like to do it again. It will ask again, okay, yes. As you see, uh, it shows an error because you already have uh, exchanged data between two of us, two of you. So that's, that's it. Thank you very much for your attention.